Hey guys, it's me again. I'm going to be telling you guys about eating healthy and exercising because I believe that a lot of girls don't really know much about um, how to keep their body nice and how to stay in shape. A lot of people have asked me, what is, what do you do for exercising? Um, how do you eat? How do you stay so healthy? Of course, nobody is perfect, so I don't think of myself as extremely skinny. I go from a size 2 or 3, so I'm not like extremely skinny or um, obese or anything. So I think that's like a normal size for girls. I'm not too sure. But I just think that every girl should know about um, what foods are healthy to eat during the day without having to like um, portion everything down all the time and really think about what you're eating every single time you eat something. I'm just going to share what I do every week so that um, maybe this can help some of you guys. So to start off with, I don't um, think about everything that I eat. I do occasionally eat bad things like ice cream. That's one of my things I eat. Probably at least once a week I have some ice cream. A lot of times I like to have a treat after I have my meal like a little Hershey Kiss or um, maybe a little cookie or some M&M's or something. I don't know, I really like chocolate, so. I do think that occasionally after every meal, you should have a little treat. So right now, I'm actually eating some mixed fruit and you can just get this from Walmart or Target or Safeway, anything like that. And it's just um, peaches, pineapple, strawberries, melon, and grapes. Um, it's an excellent source of vitamin C to have at least one or two servings of fruit a day. Um, I actually am trying to start doing this more because I, I don't really like fruit. For some reason, I only like to eat strawberries. Like if I'll have strawberries in the refrigerator, I'll definitely eat them. But if I have an apple in the refrigerator, I'm never gonna eat it. So I'm trying to force myself to eat more um, fruits and vegetables during the day. I do like to have carrots. I like to have um, I have this cream cheese that has vegetables in it, so I guess that kind of counts. Um, I like corn. Um, there's a bunch of vegetables like potatoes and stuff like that that are really good for you. Recently, I have been very, very sick. I just keep getting sick over and over again. So now I'm take, trying to take vitamins every day, so that's another thing. You should probably take vitamins every day. I'm trying to take vitamin C every day because... Um, to help with my immune system since I keep getting sick for some reason. I'm trying to eat healthier and I'm trying to work out more just so that way I feel a lot better about myself. So you definitely should have fruit every day, vegetables every day. You want to have grains like wheat every day such as um, bread and if you're going to go for bread you should definitely go for the wheat bread. That's what I go for. Um, white bread isn't so good for you. You should definitely have protein or meat. Now what I do in the morning is I'll have, my boyfriend introduced these to me, um, I'll have these, they're from Pure Protein, and I, this is the chocolate peanut butter one, this one's pretty good. I'll have a protein bar that's very high in protein, has zero grams of trans fat, and um, only two grams of sugar in one of them, and the calories are 200 in each of them, in each one, so that's actually a pretty good breakfast if you're kind of on the go, which I always aim in the morning, so definitely don't ever skip breakfast. That's a very bad idea because then you start getting extremely hungry and then by the time it's lunchtime, you're just going to like completely eat way more than you need to eat. I do like to drink milk. It's very healthy for you. Try going for the skim milk or the 2% milk. Don't try, don't drink the whole milk. That is more on the fattening side and it gives you more calories than you really need. even diet soda, even though it has no calories in it. Soda in general is very bad for you, so try and stay away from soda. And what I always do is I have um, packets and packets of water bottles that are um, in my room all the time, and I always drink water. I really don't drink anything else other than um, apple juice, cranberry juice, orange juice, or milk. So I try and always go for water. This is great. This helps with your skin, your hair, and just your whole body in general so definitely drink lots of water throughout the day 
Then for exercising, I try and exercise three or four times a week. It mostly ends up being three times a week. And then when I'm sick, which keeps happening for some reason, it'll only be once or twice. So that's not very good. My fiance and I have planned it out. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, we go to the gym. And every time I go to the gym, I used to be a cross country and track and field runner in high school. I got, um, I used to be able to do a six minute mile. So I was pretty fast back then and it's been a couple years since then so I'm trying to get back up to that point. So since I'm already, since I already know how to train myself with running, I, I know what's good for me, what I can do, what I can't do. And I like to run two miles on the treadmill on the three days that I go to the gym. And every half a mile, I switch between six, which is my normal running pace, um, and then I'll switch to eight, or like 8.5, which is my sprint. And you wanna combine sprinting with your normal jogging and a little bit of fast walking here and there, because that'll help build your heart rate, which in turn helps you lose more calories and more fat. So, that's what I do, and then after that, I'll lift weights with my boyfriend. I'll normally work on my arms, on my shoulders, or my back especially, because I actually kind of have somewhat of, um, like I kind of tend to hunch over. And then after that, I'll normally do some ab workouts, like I'll get on the ball and do some crunches, or I don't know, I'll find any way to do some crunches. You always want to work on your abs, though. So basically, that's all I do. Those are all the tips that I have for staying healthy. I hope that that helped you guys. I'll be making more videos, so stay tuned. Bye.